gum people! Man, I'm kind of getting beat up in the comments. I'm feeling a little insecure. I need to change my opinion and start kissing my viewers ass because you guys are beating me up. Yeah, that shit ain't happening. Look here. <laughs> On this incident where the security guard, they charged him with second degree murder. To be honest, I don't even know what the hell I said in the video. I kind of go off the cuff and I kind of say what I'm thinking and why I think it. But according to comments, Everyone's telling me I got it wrong. Uh, look, for, for me, I'm not saying I'm right and you're wrong, people. But I'm, I'm just trying to explain why I believe what I believe. And you're still entitled to your opinion. I look at things when it, from law enforcement and from my time dealing with the courts and search. Everything, I always look at intent. We have two people involved here. One person is trespassing and has been warned, committing a crime. The other person is actually working, doing a job, and paying taxes. So when I evaluate things on a lot of my evaluations, that really plays a lot. If I was a judge and I have a close call between two people on who's right or wrong, and one person is actually working and doing their job, even though he didn't do it correctly, even though he might have been a little aggressive, even though he might have been an asshole. If it's a close call and one guy was working and one guy was committing a crime, I'm going with the guy that was working every day of the week and twice on Sunday. That's me. I'm not saying you got to agree with that. And I may be wrong. But if there was something flagrantly wrong, I would do that. A lot of people are saying he blocked the guy in and then shot him when he couldn't leave. I think this guy has plenty of room to pull out. I'm not sure he did block him in. If he had pulled his front of the car to the front of this car, he's still in the other lane. This car can either go on this side of the car and this car. In my mind, there's two X's for this guy. Okay? So that was my big thing on this. Now look. Another thing that kind of irritated me with all you pesky citizens out there jumping on me and making me question my security is you're all saying that it's bullshit and the guy should go to prison for life. I disagree with that. Why? Because cops are doing this and you guys are falling into the government trap that it's okay for cops and it's not okay for citizens. We don't have two laws in this country for other people. The law is equal. If cops can do it, then you shouldn't be sending citizens to prison for doing the same thing. Cops do 10 times worse than this every day, and people are like, well, they're cops. Yet in this case, because you don't like cops and you want to put this guy because he's got a security guard, he's a wannabe cop, whatever. I don't care why you don't like the guy. I'm not saying this guy's a great guy and I like him. I'm just saying he's got a job. He was doing his job. This guy was trespassed. Did he need to pepper spray the car? I don't think so. Did he need to shoot him? I don't think so. But cops do 10 times worse than that, and it's okay. And if it's okay for cops, then it ought to be okay for pesky citizens. That's my default on these instances. And for some reason, people think I'm taking a security guard side. I don't like this guy because he's got a tattoo. I, 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 whatever. I'm just telling you. I don't care if you beat me up and you got your opinion. I just want you to understand why I have my opinion. And then you can still have your opinion and say I'm full of shit, whatever. You know, call me a dumbass in the comments, whatever. Whatever floats your boat and makes you happy. I'm just telling you. This guy was working. This guy was committing a crime. This guy had pepper spray when he was committing a crime. This guy had pepper spray when he was working. This guy, I know you're going to come back and go, Rick, he wasn't even supposed to have a gun. At that is a policy issue with the company, and that is a civil issue. People can sue. I don't have a problem with that. Criminally wise, I'm not sure. I don't know all the facts. I'm not sure this guy should be charged. If I go by prior police conduct and what they get away with, there's no way this guy should be charged. If the law is equal, which it's supposed to be which we all know it isn't, 
But unfortunately, all my viewers who I thought were smarter than the average viewer all fell into the trap that, well, cops can do it and it's okay, but this guy can't and he should go to prison. I, I don't believe that for a second. If cops can do it, then citizens can do it. And if cops, if citizens can't do it, then cops can't do it. That's my default. I understand there's some people that are upset with me. That's okay. We'll get over it. You can, you can give me a donut or you can give me a knife, whatever you, whatever you want to put your little emoji in there to make me feel bad or scared or intimidate me, whatever. <laughs> I, really, I just had to comment on these comments that I'm getting in here. So if you go watch the video and you read the comments, uh, probably 90% disagree with me, which I'm okay where I stand. And you know what? If I reevaluated it, maybe I'd change my mind. It's not that important to me. I just wanted you to know the two basic things that went into this. One, this guy's working. This guy's committing crimes. Two, if cops can do it, we shouldn't have a different standard for citizens. And this guy, even though he's a security guard, he's still a citizen. And that's the only reason he's getting charged. So uh, I don't know what the outcome will be, but some people are like wanting this guy to get the death penalty, wanting this guy to go to prison for life. Uh, I'm not for all that, but, you know, we'll see how it plays out. Anyway, that's my take. I want to do a follow-up on it because I'm getting a lot of heat and uh, I want to give my side shit. If I'm going to get all the freaking grief, I might as well get my side out. All right, we'll end that there. Y'all have a good one. Tomorrow uh, video is going to be a woman slapping that woman in the face on traffic stop. Great earning the hate. All right, we'll end that there.